here at this beautiful spillway and I'm gonna be doing some walleye fishing. Sunsets in about 15 minutes, Johnny's with me. We're gonna to try to get some, some walleye, hopefully some big ones. We'll see what we can do. The water's relatively clear. In that instance, it's not uncommon that I won't really catch anything until after sunset, which is in 10 minutes, but it might even be later than that when they start really biting. Starting with a swim bait, four inch paddle tail swim bait on a quarter ounce jig head, try to get it on the bottom, probably lose a few jigs. And then once it's really dark, I'm gonna definitely be throwing some bigger lures on this steep drop off, trying to get some, some really big ones. But right now, just wanna get on the board. So I'm going deep, small, uh, bait. Just try to see if I can find any fish down there eating. Just lost the lure on the snag. We have this kind of slim beauty knot to a 30 pound fluorocarbon leader. So it's less visible, you know, than the 20 pound braid, but also it's thick enough that maybe it would prevent a bite off from a muskie, you know, somewhere in between stealth and function. Speaking of muskie, stay tuned to the end of this video and I will show you that I recently went to some new muskie water and was able to catch one. Seeing bait fish swimming around, that's a very good sign. It'll give these fish a reason to come shallow once it gets a little darker. You know, the fact that there's bait around. Got one. Wow. Oh, there we go. Yeah, nice little oh, I go fish number one right on cue i'm gonna check it might be sun on the freaking nose there we go boom tied the leader on made a cast and there's a fish oh, he's not real long but it's healthy Here we go, number two. I had one swipe at the surface that was pulling out of the water. I don't think it was this one. I don't know though. I switched back to the swim bait. Alright, hopefully a sign of things to come. There we go, number three. Number four. Swim bait, yep, all swim bait. Number four. Hey, 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 hey. They're stacking up in this corner, you know? Got him. Oh, there you go. Number five. He's got pretty big head shakes. Oh, there he is. Look at his head. Good. Oh, yeah. Good fish. Four pounds, four pounds. Oh, dude. Woo. Oh, yeah. That's high quality right there, buddy. Is a that's over three pounds I'd say yeah. for sure beauty all swim bait number six seven Tony's hooked up and he's pulling drag nice fish, nice fish. Yeah, it's a little, you never can't tell when they're against the current. So but I've missed five fish so yeah. far. I've got zero fish. I'm actually frustrated beyond belief. I'm cursing. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, and, finally, and, I have a fish on. We'll see if I get this thing in. Where are we at? We've been fighting for a while. Look yeah. at that head shake. Oh, he's the, he is, he's, good. he's good. He's a good one. Good that crankbait gets the bigger ones, man. I swear. Oh, great. oh that's the big, that's the fish Praise of the day God right there. That that's I the fish of the day. Fish. Only to catch this chunk. Easy, buddy. Easy, buddy. <laughs> good. Beauty. Beauty, nowhere, man. Bro. Look at that fish. Come on. That's a chunk. That is a good one, man. Yeah. That's another over three. Yeah. I'd say for sure. Shut your light off real quick. And look at me with that. Come on. Unisco. Dude, I have been hustling for <laughs> this walleye today. Finally got one. And he is a... Uh, he's a fatty. He's perfect. He's a fall fatty, you he's, might say. He's perfect. Yep. I might kiss him. All right. Beauty. That crankbait gets the big one. Show him the crankbait. This is a... I really like that this is working. He just hooked, that's the third fish he's hooked here in not too long. It's the live target. So if, you, if you're familiar with our rivers, we have a ton of these little baby emerald shiners and that's all they eat. I mean, that's all that you see much of. I mean, there's bigger stuff, but there's a lot of these. They're, they're kind of smaller. So this live target looks like it's a school of little baby emerald shiners or something. Little school of baby shiners inside of a, you know, four that's and a it. half inch crankbait body. So. Since I put it on, I've had four fish. That's, well, that was the first one landed. Yeah, but it's working. These hooks are good, but... Very I'm nice hooks. Shawnee just left, so I stole his bait. Oh, new species. Got a sauger. And we're getting a phone call. Oh, look at that. Oh yeah. Oh. Over here, get a better look. That's a good fish. He just spit up what he's eating. He just spit up what he is eating. Let's look a look. It just came out of his mouth. It's a chub. It's a creek chub. So here's the fish. You can see him. He's almost four pounds. He is three and uh, three quarter pounds and he's 22 inches. I mean, he's really not any bigger than uh, the other two big ones we got, but he's nice. So I figured, take a look at what he weighed. That's number 10. Another sauger. Number 11, sauger number two. Sauger are generally smaller, but they look a lot like walleye, except for these black spots on the fin and sort of a blotchy. This one's kind of pale, but see that blotchiness? Almost like a cow or something with the dark, big spots on them. Kind of a cool looking fish. Hey, hey, hey. It's decent. Decent. For, for them. usual. I mean it's like 15 inches or something. Whipper snapper. Sauger number three, fish number 12. Got my last several on the live target whatever. So we got three sauger and nine walleye and then three of the walleye were 20 some inches and three between three and four pounds in the low 20s and three or four pounds. So it was a pretty good night. Before I go, let me show you this cool musky spot that I just checked out for the first time and was able to catch a small one. Got him, got him, got him, got him, got him. Get him, get him. Ah. 
good work, baby. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Full skis out here after dropping the anchor. Beautiful. We had Absolutely. two misses from Muskie, uh, then a missed uh, pike, and now we finally got one. He's a little guy, but so satisfying to catch a Muskie on purpose <laughs> of any size. 28 incher, hit the glider, absolutely slammed it. So we're hoping that this is a sign of things to come. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and stay tuned for the next one.